Hi everybody, it's Opulent Spiritual, another reading. So this is gonna be for all Scorpios, Sun, Moon, Rising. You know, whenever, whatever you have a... Uh... Wherever, whenever, we're meant to be together. I'll be there and you'll be near. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay, somebody you're connected to, they, I don't know. Okay, um, yeah, so... <laughs> Uh, all right. Um, let me get through my intro. Can you relax? Jeez. All right, Scorpio, you're here. You could be dealing with a Gemini, by the way. Um, this is for April 2024. All right, you already know the dealio here. Um, darkness is here. I'm seeing darkness. Darkness. You guys could be in like your dark feminine, you know dark masculine i don't know like that vampire shit i don't know all right you're like very like seductive or i'm hearing lucifer i don't want to feel this shit so hold on let me cleanse this shit out because i don't know what is happening here but hold up let me just cleanse this shit a little bit because it's getting a little too dark here okay la 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 All right. All right. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs> Give me a like, subscribe, you know, whatever. Right. Okay. Thank you for being here. All right. So very interesting. Okay. Uh, one of your wishes is coming true because this shit was stuck and you got a lot of stuff in there. And you got a big effing thing coming out all the way on the bottom here. You have a big communication coming to you from spirit. Wow, very interesting cup already. Someone's traveling very quick to towards you. Okay, we just spilled a bunch of coffee on here. Right towards you. Very quickly. I'm telling you, there's someone coming towards you, like, very quickly. Here, look at this. Especially, like, um, what do we got here? Sagittarius, you're the snake. If you're waiting for some kind of money or something, I'm seeing you, like, getting a big-time money here, too. But someone traveling towards you in love. Look at this. Look at look at that. There's a com There's a cycle completing here. Look at this. It's over. It's done. I've never seen anything like that before with the coffee. Chinese year of the monkey is here as well. Money. It's, it's something connected to money here. Big time. Cycle is closing up. Wow. And it's, and it's steady. It's secure money. It's not like money you're just going to get and then that's it. No, this is like big time. Wow. Look at, look at this effing cup. This is amazing. And it's raining like very heavy here. Okay, so I'm seeing a lot of runes here um, at the bottom. So you're very connected to spirit and I don't know if you have like Viking roots or you're connected to that area or you have ancestors but they're trying to talk to you and communicate to you. Uh, very potent energy here um, for April. You have an X there. You can see it. You have Aries, letter C. Um, hold on, let me uh, get my rune card thing. So hold on a second, let me get that. see what I'm seeing here all right so we have uh, gifts personal or relationships wow so someone could be gifting you something or you're gifting someone something okay that's the first thing 
Um, the next one is, okay, sorry, that one was called Gibo. This one's called Taiwaz. Justice Authority Analysis. So you could be getting justice in something here. Hmm. And I'm also seeing this one. Fehu, Fehu, money, hope, luck, and success. And and this one, it's like very strange. Hold on, what is this? Yeah, it's this one. Jira, peace, happiness, hope, earlier efforts. Wow, are you serious? I'm looking at this, by the way, um, while I'm looking at the cup. Oh my gosh, bro. And there's like coffee that is right here that's spilled out. You have so much money coming to you. Oh my gosh, I didn't even do anything yet. All right. <sighs> All right, Year of the Ox is here, Taurus. Year of the Rooster. Okay, right right in the beginning, there's a lot of changes here uh, with your job. They're moving people around. You, there's, there's changing of shifts here. A lot of people are talking, gossiping, and you're kind of just like in the background. You're not trying to be in anybody's way. You're just trying to get through the day and move on with your life. But like, you can't escape this. It's something very heavy here. It's very... It's very dark here. I'm seeing Chinese Year of the Tiger here, Year of the Rabbit. And I'm also seeing something about recycling here, like re you're recycling or you need to recycle, or this is something about like um, you taking care of your body, your health, like making sure you're, you're, you know, getting rid of like the toxins and stuff like that. Like recycling is very important here this month. And this is what's very interesting here. Mm. It's like I just breathed in really weird. So I, I'm getting like, this is like an energy of defense because this is giving me like a club breaking a bone. I don't know, maybe you're gonna get into a fight with somebody that you're gonna wanna break their face or something or like, a, like their bone or something, I don't know. I see like a club, like a club with like spikes on it and like wanting to beat somebody up with, I don't know. That's like very strange, very dark um, energy here. You're fed up, you're done. You do not want to deal with this shit anymore. All right, that's just confirmation right there. But I feel like you're gonna be digging something out. Like something's been like, lingering on you and you're finally going to just get rid of it and dig it out because it's just like it's just underneath the skin now it's just like you're it's just annoying and it's bothering you and you're just over it you're ready to commit to like ending this shit like you're ending it virgo could be significant you're the monkey but it's like you want to get rid of this shit And I'm seeing like a floating island here in the sky. And I'm seeing someone like offering to the sky. It's like a, a God here. It looks like Buddha to me, like Tibet, like Tibetan Buddha. There's like offerings here. 
it's like something like beyond in another like realm wow you guys have a very spiritual cup i don't know what's going on here number seven chinese year of the horse there's offerings like blessings there's like egyptian stuff here like anunnaki stuff i don't know it's like otherworldly things atlantis and there's like a bunch of people like cheering and happy here it's like maybe you're like a chosen one here i don't know it's like you're being chosen here your ancestors are choosing you and you're de like I, this is obviously this is not for everybody but this is like your chosen one here sorry you're like a chosen one here and i'm seeing the chariot like you're very quick to move on you're moving quickly now you're getting you're given the power to move on very quickly i'm seeing medusa here too like a medusa energy you're using your power one so Aries, the first house, it's all about you. You know what I mean? Like yourself, your independence, your self-awareness, who you are. Let her be. And I'm seeing someone like flying on like a helicopter here. And I mean, it's like, you know, seeing from a different perspective of beyond. It's like, you know... Like seeing things that other people can't see, you know? <sighs> Very interesting. Letter A, number seven. And we have Year of the Dragon here. Letter C. I mean, you could see it right there. Hmm. And I'm seeing there's a triangle here. year of the rooster and this is not like a love triangle this is like you being protected and divinely guided i'm seeing you working very hard there's like two hammers here i don't know <laughs> like there's something where you're gonna have to defend yourself and then someone you're gonna find out was like whoever like ghosted you there's like a ghosting energy here somebody ghosted you they're still watching you they still have feelings for you or they want to be with you now like maybe they went with somebody else but it's like they already broke your trust like i'm seeing someone breaking um a bond here i don't know 16 37 8 year of the goat leo I'm here in prosperity and joy. And look at, look how very, this is how interesting this is. It looks like um, a portal. So towards the end of the month, I'm seeing you like, once you go through, cause there's a lot of transits this month. Once you go through, look at all this like coffee though. Once you go through this, this um, portal, this opening, especially towards like the end of April, there's no turning back. There's no going back to, to the way things were. There's not. For all of us, not just you. For all the signs. But for some reason, it's very particular for you. For something, it's probably because of Pluto, you know? Because your sign's connected to Pluto. Like heavy-duty karma closing out. And I'm seeing like uh, like a knight's helmet, but like the ones that the, the gladiators used to use. That's what I'm seeing. You know, like 300, you know, like that movie. <laughs> it's like really fighting for this, like fighting. Maybe you're fighting the change. And I'm seeing someone sitting um, with their legs crossed, but they're naked and they're, it's just their back showing. It's not like the front. So there could be something with your spine or you have scoliosis. 
or there's something about you like being vulnerable just letting it all hang out here and you have a lot of eights here and you have om here as well mm. going into prayer and meditation mm. Look at the plate. How interesting. Something about like a pool. Swimming. You could be like a swimmer. Or you do that for exercise. I'm here on Vagabond. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there's like a major, major obstacle here that you've been either going through. I'm here in 15 years. 15 years, bro? What? I'm also seeing a pot here to like cook, boil like macaronis and stuff. Macaronis. So maybe you're cooking some kind of meal or you're like having some kind of dinner. That's going to be significant this month. And I'm also seeing, look at this like beautiful star with the moon here. It's like faith and trust and spirituality is like big for you this month. Like things are going to happen for you this month that you're going to be like, wow, that I've never seen. Like it's going to be like unexplainable things. But like, come on, you guys are Scorpio. So you already know. Like, look at this shit. Definitely a path is opening up for you. And, and it's and it's life changing here. It's going to change your life. You need to change. You need to change because you're scared. You're very scared and you're worried. But spirits protecting you here. Look at this. Look. And I'm telling you something with travel. Someone's traveling towards you. There's like a lot of it's very quick. You're going to have to make quick decisions here. And it's, and it's interesting. I'm seeing like a paw print here, but it looks like a bear paw, like, like Native American kind of stuff. Letter G. So it's like protection from your ancestors. I'm telling you. Letter D and letter F is here as well. And there's like a big um, hummingbird here. Like, look at that. So it's like, you know, receiving what you need. But you could be having anxiety, you know, and fears about it. Okay, let me see. This is way longer. I don't remember what I did with the other ones, but they weren't as long as this. So, Scorpio. Look at this mountain road. But I, that's the mountain I saw on... Look at this. Wow. This just flipped out. Wealth. You're on the road to success. Yeah, money. That's I told you. That's like what's happening. Okay. Um, that's too many. Okay, I'm here. Scorpio needs to know. All right, well, calm down. All right, hold up. We have March here. This all started maybe happening already. Getting together with friends. Year of the dog is here. Look at this good news. So it's all happening. It's right here. All right. What else? What else for Scorpio? Strength. You could have Leo placements, dealing with a Leo. You're very strong, very powerful right now. Wow, King of Wands. This could be someone coming towards you to help you. Maybe this is someone that's in love interested in you. You know what I mean? Wow, and there's communication here. Look at all this like fast energy. Within the next eight days, you could be hearing about this. The 8th of April. And the 8th of April is the eclipse. Yeah, and there could be like a party, a celebration, something you're invited to, friends, family. Something's going to make you very happy after a time you're feeling sad. And I don't know, this is like abuse here. But spirit's always been with you right here. But someone, you're leaving somebody behind or you're leaving like a toxic situation. Someone that was manipulating you, being abusive. You're leaving that. Okay. Let me see what else is happening. here. You could be going to New York. All right, he, so you could be dealing with a, 
masculine here. A man. I'm seeing sorry here. So maybe somebody wants to apologize to you. Wow, you got the you got the door. Like look at this shit. It actually like opens up. Yeah, so it's, it's I'm telling you, it's that was the outside of the cup. Like a brand new door is opening up for you. Yeah. Water signs, secrets here. Yeah, and you're being divinely guided with this lighthouse. You're you're being shown the way. By spirit. Yeah, you're seeing something in a, a different perspective. Different perspective here. And there's something where you're going to be chilling. You're going to be able to relax. I'm telling you, maybe you're just going away. Yeah, lighthearted. I'm getting a lot of summertime energy here. Look at this. You could be dealing with another water sign. But it's like being cautious. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Quadrant, I'm hearing. Dr. Dre. Dr. Dre. Dex, Dexter. Yeah, and you know that show Dexter, like, it's like dark, you know? I'm getting like that dark kind of energy. I was getting that in the beginning. Faye. Boyfriend. N. Y. Yeah, New York. Zero, and that was on the outside. Yeah, you're completing a cycle. And maybe you're going to say no to somebody. Or yo, yo, and you're going to be turned on here. What does it say? Live your dream. Yeah, you're going to be living your dream or living the dream. I don't know, because of all this money, you're going to feel like, damn, I'm living the dream here because I'm seeing fun here. Zen, you're going to be feeling Zen after all this stuff. Connecticut's here. Uh, let me see what else do I see. Dread. A fan. Maybe you have like a fan or like fans. Maybe you do something where you have like fans. People watch you. All right. That's all I have for you. Thank you so much. I love you guys. And I'll see you in the next one. Namaste. Love and light.